I now will call upon Francis Parono, pa Paronto, this year's valedictorian, to give the valedictory address. Chancellor Cody, President and Vice Chancellor Carr, Dr. Sanderson, distinguished guests, family and friends, and most importantly, my fellow graduates. I am honored to have been selected to address you today on behalf of the Faculty of Arts and Science Class of 2024. First and foremost, congratulations to each and every one of you who will step on stage today to receive your diploma. We made it. Aujourd'hui représente le point culminant de tous vos efforts lors des dernières années. Que vous vous dirigiez vers des études graduées ou bien sur le marché du travail, c'est maintenant l'heure de tourner la page et de passer à la prochaine étape. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Francis Paranto, and I have been a student in the Health, Kinesiology, and Applied Physiology Department. Between my bachelor's and doctorate degrees, I have spent almost a third of my life here at Concordia. <laughs> Needless to say, a big part of the person I am today was shaped by my experiences here, and I am grateful for it. Therefore, I would like to take advantage of this platform today to share with you all two lessons I've learned and that I think we can all apply moving forward. The first lesson university taught me was time management. When reflecting back on our first semester at Concordia, I'm sure we can all think of moments where we did not think we would manage to get everything done in time. We have all been guilty of postponing the completion of an assignment until the day before it was due, and then proceeded to stay up late until uh, only to submit it by the infamous 11.59 p.m. deadline. <laughs> and how about occasionally skipping a lecture so we could squeeze in an extra study session for a midterm? We've all been there, and the list goes on. But what is incredible is that we got it done. We've, in a sense, procrastination taught us how to manage our time and prioritize what was most important. And that is a skill everyone here now possesses. One that will be extremely useful as we embark in the next chapter of our lives. It may have put us in situations where we felt overwhelmed, but it forced us to be resourceful and to step up to the challenge. Moving forward, I hope you keep this in mind and rely on these acquired skills when faced with countless tasks to accomplish. On many occasions, we also had to seek out help and rely on others, which brings me to the second lesson I have learned during my time at Concordia. This one is about the importance of networking and building relationships. Just take a moment to look around you. You are surrounded by amazing classmates who, just like you, have persevered and successfully completed their degree. This achievement would not have been possible without the connections you have made along the way. Whether it be a friend you made during Frosh who later invited you to join their study group, or a lab partner who just seemed to understand everything and help you pass the class, we, we all had to rely on someone at some point during our degree. Now look behind me. Here are professors who are experts in their field and who have transferred their knowledge to you. They have answered your questions, opened their door during office hours, and perhaps they've even given you tough love when you needed it. Finally, look behind you. Your family members and friends who have supported you in your journey are here today to cheer you on. Perhaps you don't realize it, but you are now equipped with a vast network of potential colleagues, mentors, and friends to support you. Take advantage of that. Lean on one another. Ask for advice. You will find that when you do so, great opportunities will present themselves. Pour conclure, je vous souhaite à tous et à toutes de continuer à apprendre et à vous épanouir dans tout ce que vous désirez entreprendre. Class of 2024, it has been quite the ride, and I'm thrilled to see what we're going to accomplish next. May our past experiences at Concordia and the people we have met along the way help guide us through our future endeavors. Thank you.
Thank you, Francis, Dr. Paranto, for your inspirational message. Just remember, everyone, time management and networking. Don't forget.